those DVRs because you are not going to win the miss tonight's premiere of the new show Red Band Society right here on Fox 7. Joining us this morning, our next guests are Zoe Levin and Charlie Rowe. Both of them are stars of the new program. Welcome to both of you. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Hello. Great to have you guys here. Hey, tell me uh, about the show and why our viewers need to tune in. There's a lot of a lot of buzz about the Red Band Society. It is. The Red Band Society is uh, a show about teenagers in hospital. And um, what's so fantastic about it is that it is that it focuses on the absolute reality and normality of, of adolescence and teenage life um, and the fun that these kids have while they go, you know, while... They're in an unfortunate situation. Yeah, so it's an, it's an interesting mix of just um, the hilarity of being a teenager and then the, the very scary moments of having um, serious illnesses. Right, there's a little bit of comedy, there's a little bit of drama. Having seen the, uh, the pilot episode, I can definitely tell our viewers that it's a great show and I'm looking forward to seeing what, what happens with your characters. Um, speaking of your characters, there are so many layers to them. Zoe, Kara, she's kind of a mean girl, but our understanding is that there's, there's a whole lot more to her than just what we're going to see in the pilot. Yeah, I mean, that's initially why I was drawn to the part because she could be seen as such this stereotypical mean girl cheerleader type but um, there's a lot going on under underneath it all and you know there mean girls are mean for a reason so I was excited to um, play someone that was had to you know face death and really kind of question her um, character a little bit and um, she needs a heart, so she needs to kind of improve her attitude and, you know, grow up a little bit. So it's right. fun. It's been a really, really great part to play. Yeah, she needs a heart in more ways than one, but I think we're going to see a, a lot of development from both uh, Kara and yes. Leo in the coming episodes. Last but not least, the series has been so well received by critics. Why do you think that? Sorry, you cut out there. The, uh, the series, a lot of critics are saying that it's one of the best new series to come out this fall. Why do you think they're saying that? What, what, what makes it so good? Because it's, it's a good show. Uh, well, I mean, ho hopefully they're telling the truth. <laughs> um, I, think, I think the reason why it, it, um, it is great is that it... Is it, it's just it's ambitious. It's, it's an unusual idea, and it's an idea that when you tell people, they immediately go, "Oh God, I'm gonna, I'm gonna be terrified." That's a bit scary. Um, and they've done a very good job at at, make, at at making it accessible and interesting and exciting and um, and relatable to mm -hmm. to watch. So uh, I think that's why it it, it could do well. Oh, and, I hope so. Yeah, and, and all of us here in the, uh, the Fox family certainly hope that it does well. Wish both of you lots of luck and remind our viewers that Red Band Society premieres tonight. Best of luck to both of you.